The frontline workers want nothing more than their overdue COVID-19 risk allowances to be paid. Raise our concerns now to the media using our union muscle to uh, hear our grievances on the issue of um, COVID risk allowance payment, which was not paid to the uh, nurses at Port Moresby General Hospital who were directly in contact with the COVID uh, positive patients. The concerns supported strongly by the PNG Nurses Association. I am very supportive of them, my national executives. We are fully supportive of their move and we are only giving the government, the health secretary and his team to respond to the petition by 4.06 tomorrow. The nurses want the government to respond by the end of the working day tomorrow or face a sit-in protest at the Port Mosby General Hospital. The Nurses Association also questioned the priorities of the health department, which it claims has given more attention to support services. We also would like the secretary to tell us what criteria he has used to see it fit to only pay NCDC staff who only come work in the morning shift, the corporate staffs who only sit in the office and the catering. Uh, company and not addressing or paying nurses who have worked as frontliners. The Port Mosby General Hospital is the country's biggest referral hospital with over 800 nurses. Since the start of the pandemic, 138 nurses were confirmed with COVID-19 whilst serving on the front line of the response and in the wards they serve. Bradley Valenaki, National MTV News.